everyone! Today I'm going to be showing you how I made these Sprinkles Cupcakes nails. I had a family member who was having a birthday party that was cupcake themed, so I made these just for fun. In case you don't know what Sprinkles Cupcakes is, it's a cupcake bakery that originated here in Southern California. It's considered one of the first cupcake bakeries and I went there a lot as a college student in LA. And one of the founders is actually one of the judges on Cupcake Wars, which is a program on the Food Network, one of my guilty pleasures to watch. I started out by looking at the Sprinkles website and deciding which cupcakes I wanted to paint on each nail. Of course you can just do one cupcake on each nail, but I'm crazy and wanted them all to be different. I wrote the actual cupcake color down, as well as the color of the frosting, the signature circles that go on top of the Sprinkles cupcakes, as well as the little dot that's in the middle. And so I gathered my top coat and a bunch of different colors, as well as my two thinnest brushes for detailing. I'm using the red velvet cupcake nail as an example. After putting on my top coat and rounding out all of my nail tips, since it's going to be the top of the cupcake, I took the cupcake color and painted my nails like normal, except I left a diagonal slit on the side of each nail. I made an outline starting from where the crescent on the bottom of my nail ended and up to the corners of my nails and filled it in. And I repeated this on all the other nails, paying close attention to what color I'm supposed to be using. After that, to create the frosting tip, I took the frosting color, drew a curve, and filled it up to the tip. For some of these, I had to put on two coats since some of the colors I used were kind of sheer. After that, I took my bigger detailing brush and started drawing on all the little circles in the middle of the frosting. After that, I took the smaller detailing brush and put the little dot in the center of each of them. And easy, they're done! All the dots look a little irregular, but I still think they're really cute nails to have for any cupcake themed occasion. I definitely recommend getting some proper nail tools, which is what I should have done, to make even circles and dots for all the nails. As you can see, each nail is a different Sprinkles cupcake. I put their very popular red velvet on my left thumb, and my personal favorite chocolate marshmallow on my right thumb. And if you haven't had a Sprinkles cupcake before, I really hope that you get a chance to try one. They're really rich and the frosting is to die for. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next Tuesday for another Musy Mouthy. Thanks, goodbye!